Welcome at Smile with my perfectly imperfect, exuberating, joyous smile. I exuberated to you with love and joy so that you can receive the energy. So I've had a wonderful work day. Right. And now that I have no one to go home to and I'm not in a rush to go to the shelter, I asked my boss if I could stay. She said, yes, they need the assistance. So we're going to break down those pallets. Time for some overtime. Now, because it is my child's birthday, it is not midnight yet, and I do not have the ability to hug and kiss him, I do have the ability to express to him how important, special, and loved he is. So, welcome. This is the opportunity for me to do that, and I'm going to. Jaleel, my love, I pray to God that your birthday was peaceful, fulfilling, that you do feel more mature, that you can acknowledge the changes that you have gone through in the 14 years that you have lived on this earth, that you know that I love you no matter the circumstances or where we are. I want you to know that a lot of parents that stay home with their kids got kids in diapers, two, three years old. When you was one years old, you was walking, you was fully potty trained in underwear, rocking fly ass clothes and talking as best you could. You ain't never been slow. <laughs> yes, I love my child. I made a decision to not be a welfare baby mama. I don't get child support. I had a love child, not a benefit income, right? So I made sacrifices as best I understood and believed and left him with those that I believed would love and care for him as best they knew, my parents, right? So thank you, my parents for being the grandparents that you are, to the best abilities that you have. And Jalil, we will be together this summer. I guarantee it. I could put my life on that. Believe it. Your mama's not going back to jail. Right. I make better decisions today. It's okay to be bold and fierce, but nothing is worth your freedom. I love you, my child. Nothing comes before you. Well, God, and being able to provide for us, but nothing, your health, your mental status, and your emotional health come first in my life. Know that. And I don't have to physically be there to be your mother. Right. So for all the people that don't believe that, I have the capacity, that ain't none of your business. When I was physically present in my child's life, I know I gave the best of myself. How many parents are walking around here with two and three kids in diapers? Two and three years old. Kids don't know how to talk, say shit. Right. That's negligence. But me, that sold drugs. Right. My kid knew better. So critique me. Talk about me. I know who I am. And I want my son to know you are far from average. I love you. And you are everything that your name stands for. So live in it. I love you.